Good morning. Uh, Sunday, 8 a.m. ish, somewhere on there, and I'm on my five-minute exercise walk <laughs> just to get the paper, papier and fly, paper and milk, and the uh, yeah, like I say, exercise for five minutes. And they cut the uh, path. Wow, what a lovely smell! I think they did this a couple of days ago. It was getting well overgrown. Dandelions are spreading. Oh, that smell. Um, yeah, the uh, English government have changed their rules slightly. Uh, unlimited exercise and unlimited travel. You can drive whatever you want in England, though, not in Wales. Because the uh, Welsh government, uh, we're still in lockdown in Wales. Um, we can exercise now more than once, but only local. We can't, like, um, in, in England, you can drive 20, 30 miles or what have you to a beauty spot, do your exercise and then drive back, but you can't in Wales. Um, like if I wanted to go to Snowdonia, what have you, or Betos, Betos or Coy, something like that, I could drive there, about 40 minute drive, do my exercise, then come back, but I'm not allowed to do that at the moment. That's the Welsh government rules. But in England, you can, but it must be just in England. Um, but what's happening is people are thinking, oh, yeah, unlimited travel, let's go to Snowdonia, um, go up Snowdon, but it's not allowed. As soon as they cross the border, the rules, whether it's law, don't think it's law, sorry, <laughs> stopping you. Uh, <laughs> whether it's law, um, but it's rules, isn't it? You know, but people are getting fined. Um, but uh, that's what's happening, they're coming over the border. And people have been fined, as, as, I think it's a few thousand, that, and that's just in Wales. And the police have wanted to put the fine up. Currently it's £30, and if they catch you again, it's £60. But some of the, well, the two police chiefs in North Wales, they want to make it £3,000 fine and what have you. But that's what's happening, people are. <laughs> Why do people, <laughs> just come out of the garage there. And they stare at you because you're standing here talking to a camera. And they think, oh, what's he doing? <laughs> you get used to it. Yeah, but that's what's happening. They're coming over the border. And like I say, the rules have changed. And they're getting fined. Like I say, I can't. It's only local. I can't drive to, say, if I wanted to go to Mulvamai, I would normally, say, drive to, to Bodfari or Rithin. Get out of the car and go to Mulvamai and back. But I can't. The rules say you must stay local. Anyway, I'm going to get me papier and slice. And I'll speak to you when I come back out. I'll just tuck this in my jacket and I get me uh, papier and slice. Very quiet on the railroad here. My camera's coming loose. Hang on, bear with me. Better. Right, hang on, got me. Get 
get organised. <laughs> yeah, see, so that's the main road coming in. If you're coming off the A55 into Denby, that's the way you're heading in. That's into Denby. And, well, you probably can't see on this camera, but top of the hill there, it's Denby Castle, highest point of Denby Town. Probably can't see it for this camera because it's such a wide angle lens, but Castell Denby. Pop here and fly. Yes, like I say, Wales have different rules to England. Come across the border from England and you're more than likely going to get fanged. Uh, but yeah, anyway, I got to uh, some ciders to be sampled. Got quite a few today. Aspinall, is it? Something like that. Thatcher's Gold. Got Vintage Cider. My own Scrumpy. 8 9%. Our guy closed. This park is closed. But you get one or two walking their dogs and stuff like that. But that's nothing to worry about, is it? Wow, it's a lovely smell on this grass. Yeah, I got some pork chop I'm going to do today. Like peri peri and garlic it. Uh, like I say, some ciders and uh, might do some Yorkies, I don't know yet. But anyway, that's the end of this uh, five minute, whatever it was, my exercise. Back now to sample some ciders and cook a pork chop. So, thanks for watching. And no doubt I'll see you, see you next Sunday, 8 o'clock, best part of the day. <laughs>